Hello everyone. Welcome to Learn Reality Consult. Ladies and gentlemen, today I'm doing a video on the glorious places to check out on Google Earth. So this video is gonna be quick and I want you to check out some glorious places on Google Earth. I call them the 10 wonders of the world. So let's get started. Go to your Google Earth Pro. Our first place that I want to explore is Mount Everest. That's the number 10 on the list. It's Mount Everest. So let's go to Mount Everest. This is Mount Everest. Mount Everest is the world peak mountain above sea level, which is 8,848 meters. It can be found in the Himalayas on the Nepal and China border. Mount Everest attracts many experienced mountaineers as well as trainee climbers who are willing to pay considerable sums of money to professional mountain guards to help them complete a season. By the close of the year 2000 climbing season, there had been 4,102 ascents to the summit by about 2,700 individuals all over the world. Climbers are a significant source of tourist revenue for Nepal, whose government also require all prospective climbers to obtain an exorbitant permit, costing about $25,000 US dollars per person. So it's really expensive uh, to explore or to climb Mountain Everest. So that is the number 10 on our list, the tallest mountain in the world that is mountain everest so now let's go to our number nine on our list the number nine on our list is one of the glorious places you can visit by using google app pro so the number nine on our list is antomion antomion is a national monument that is located in Brazil's in Belgium. So the Antomion is a world class monument, as I said, located in Brazil. Formerly built for Expo 58, 1958 Brazil's World's Fair. This nice monument was designed by Andre Wataki. It is 102 meters tall, that is about 335 feet. It has nine steel spheres. You see them? One, two, three, four, four, six, eight, nine. Nine connected together so that the wall forms the shape of a unit cell of iron crystal magnified 165 billion times. Such a magnificent. Uh, monument. I have been very lucky to visit this monument in Belgium. Such a nice feeling to stand by this great monument. So the top sphere here uh, provides a panoramic view of Brazos, the town of Brazos. When you stand here. You should be able to view the whole town of Brazos. Each sphere is 18 meters in diameter. So each sphere is 18 meters in diameter. Three spheres are currently closed to visitors. Others can be reached easily by escalators. The vertical vertex contains a lift which was very fast. And advanced at the time of Odin. That is, the speed was five uh, minutes per second. 
So that's our number nine glorious places that you can visit with Google Earth. So now, our number eight glorious place that you can visit is the city of Rome. Rome is such a very beautiful uh, city. And then that is where you can see the Vatican City, the resident of the Pope, the head of the Catholic Church in the whole world. See magnificent edifice. Some of this edifice has been constructed long, 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 long years ago. But they still look magnificent. This is Rome. So that's the number eight on our list is the city of Rome. So now let's move to our number seven glorious place that you can visit with the help of Google Earth. And is the Hoover Dam. We are moving to Hoover Dam. Hoover Dam is one of the number seven glorious places that you can visit with Google Earth. And this is the Hoover Dam. Hoover Dam is a concrete arc gravity dam located in the Black Cayon of Colorado River on the border between U.S. states of Nevada and Arizona. The period of construction of the dam is between 1931 and 1936 during the Great Depression. Its construction was the result of enormous effort involving multitude of workers cost over 100 lives. Meaning a lot of people die during the construction of this uh, dam. Originally known as the Boulder Dam from 1933, it was officially renamed Hoover Dam for President Herbert Hoover by a joint resolution of Congress in 1947. So it's our number seven glorious places that you can visit with the help of Google. So our number six glorious place that you can visit with Google Earth is the Stonehenge. Is the Stonehenge. Stonehenge. Let's move to Stonehenge. This is Stonehenge. Stonehenge is a, a prehistoric monument located in English country of Wiltshire about 3.2 km west of Amesbury and 13 km north of Salisbury. Stonehenge is composed of earthworks surrounding a circular set of large standing stones. It is at the center of the densest complex of Neolithic and Bronze Age monuments in England, including several hundred barrier Mount. So, our number five glorious places that you can visit with the help of Google Earth is the Mount Rushmore. Let's move to Mount Rushmore. This is Mount Rushmore. Very impressive sculptures. Mount Rushmore National Memorial is centered on a massive sculpture curved into the granite face of Mount Rushmore in the Black Hills in Keystone, South Dakota. Sculptor Gazon Babylon created the sculpture's design and oversaw the project execution from 1927 to 1941 with the help of his son, Link Babylon. The sculpture features a 60 foot, that's 80 meter hairs of President George Washington, 1732 to 1799, that's his ring, Thomas Jefferson from 1743 to 1826, and Theodora Roosevelt from 1858 to 1919, 
and Abraham Lincoln, 1809-1865, as a recommended by Buckland. The four presidents were chosen to represent the nation's birth, growth, and development preservation, respectively. The memorial park covers 1,278 acres, and the actual mountain has an elevation of 5,725 feet above sea level. Great mountains with great men. That is the president, former president of the United States of America. So, our number four glorious place that you can visit. It is the, the forbidden city in Beijing, China. This is it. It's one of the forbidden, that's the forbidden city. The Forbidden City was a Chinese imperial uh, palace from the Ming Dynasty to the end of the Qin Dynasty. It is located in the middle of Beijing, China, and now houses the Palace Museum. For almost 500 years, it served as the home of emperors and their household, as well as the ceremonial and political center of Chinese government. Such a massive Edifice. Built in 1406 to 1420, the complex consists of 980 buildings with 8,707 bays of homes and covers 720,000 meters square. The palace complex exemplifies traditional Chinese palatial architecture and has influenced cultural and architectural development in East Asia and elsewhere. The Forbidden City was declared a World Heritage Site in 1987 and is listed by United UNESCO as the largest collection of preserved Asian wooden structures in the whole world. So our third glorious place that you can visit with Google Earth is the Toi Eiffel Tower. In France, this is the tower, Twyfold Tower in France. No good in pronunciation in, in French, so bear with me. Uh, the Twyfold Tower is a, a route iron lettered tower on the Champ de Mars in uh, Paris, France. It's named after the engineer Gustave Eiffel whose company designed and built the tower. Locally nicknamed La Dame de Fer, French for Iron Lady, it was constructed from 1887 to 1889 as the entrance to the 1889 World's Fair and was initially criticized by some of France's leading artists and intellectuals for its design. But it has become a global culture icon for France and one of the most recognizable structures in the whole world. The Eiffel Tower is the most visited paid monument in the world. 6.91 million people ascended it in 2015. Wow, such a, a nice monument. So our number two glorious place that you can visit with the aid of Google Earth is the Great Walls of China. Great Walls of China. Great Walls of China. Historical monument. There was such a long wall that was built around some province of China. So, the Great Wall of China is a series of fortifications that were built across historical northern borders of ancient Chinese states and imperial China as a protection against various nomadic groups from the Eurasian state. Several walls were built from as early as the 7th century BC. And then, Number one on our list is the Pyramid of Giza. 
that is it tops our list. That is it, the pyramid of Gaza. The pyramid of Gaza is the oldest is the oldest and the largest of three pyramids in Gaza, pyramid complex bordering the present day Gaza in Greater Cairo, Egypt. Is the oldest of the seven wonders of the ancient world, and the only one to remain largely intact. Its Egyptologists believe that the pyramid was built as a tomb for the fourth dynasty, Egyptian pharaoh Khafu, over a 20 year period, of including around 2560 BC, initially standing at 146.5 meters. The Great Pyramid was the tallest man made structure in the world for more than 3,800 years. It is estimated to weigh approximately 6 million tons, it consists of 2.3 million blocks of limestone and granite, some weighing as much as 80 tons. It was built by Extracting huge stones from the quarry and lifting them into the palace. So, these are the 10 glorious places that you can visit with the aid of the Google uh, Earth. So, it is amazing to see these kind of um, things, and it is practically impossible to travel to these locations but with the help of Google Earth. We have seen the top 10 most glorious places that you can visit with the aid of the Google Earth. So kindly subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell to see more important videos. Bye bye.